solid operation, Commander. Here's the tactical upload on our next op. The Hodger Peninsula was home to many of your family's military facilities. When Steiner attacked, they seized them to use as staging bases. Many of your father's troops evaded capture and, with Peter's help, formed the core of a guerrilla force. They've reclaimed several abandoned fire bases and are using them to stage their operations. But they'll need our help. We'll weaken the local defenses and help the resistance liberate needed equipment and ultimately personnel. Personnel? We know that Steiner shipped many of your father's elite troops to a prison camp somewhere in the region. If we can find the camp and liberate the prisoners, they could provide the manpower and the expertise the resistance needs to carry the fight to the rest of Cantaris. Our first mission will be to raid a major Steiner supply base. Resistance forces will arrange distraction so we can storm the base and liberate supplies. The base is well defended, but there's a lot of equipment there that we and the Resistance need. The mission's a hot drop. We don't want to risk losing surprise. I'll get us set up. And I'll start my search for that prison camp. The Resistance lives. Despite Steiner boasts, Resistance forces still loyal to the memory of Duke Eric have won small victories in several Kentari cities and scored a major success in the Olympian reaches. There, resistance forces overcame Steiner patrols and destroyed a military dropship, severely weakening the Steiner occupation. There are reports that members of Duke Eric's family have survived and are leading the attacks that are tearing down Lord Roland's wall of lies. He will not be able to hide behind it much longer. Listen and spread the word. All right, guys. Sorry for the nice long delay between uploading. I. Uh I had a power supply failure that happened about two weeks ago, there, thereabouts, a week and a half, yeah, somewhere in there. Yeah, so that kind of took me out of the action for a bit. So, well, now I'm back. Welcome back, guys. Uh, this is a desert area. This is not exactly my favorite cup of tea here, especially in this game. Uh, since the heat physics don't work like they do in the original one, it's going to suck. Very bad. Um, let's see, for starters, we did pick up this mauler, which is always a good thing. Um, it's a nice heavy mech. It comes with reactive armor, so I'm kind of torn whether I want to use it or not right now. Uh, I'll figure that out in a minute. Like I said, this is desert heavy, so this ain't gonna be fun. And that's putting it very lightly. Uh, the hard points on this mech just blow. When I say blow, I mean they really, really, really blow. I'm just gonna strip the vulture down really fast. I kind of want to run two large pulses for the shits and giggles factor. It's there. Um, I have plenty of AC2. I don't have two Gauss rifles either. Or, yeah. Believe it or not, AC2s do a lot of damage anyway. So. They, they, they got a huge extremely huge freaking buff between uh, mech 4 and mech 3 need some short range action here kinda short range speed is not of the essence here either AMS heat sinks I'm kind of curious what will happen if I dump all that down. I'm trying to just not use that AC2s for like everything. That's my biggest concern. But I got an idea. How about... This is 
city for that. That's not that armor right there. So it pretty much should be a walking tank. For the most part, that is. You can tell I'm still a little bit skeptical here. I'm just worried about my heat, if anything. That's it. Speed is not of the essence here. Very not of the essence. Five tons. Upgrade to an LR15. Wait, the heat's still good. I kind of like that setup right there. And we're gonna go with this desert. Sounds good. Sounds good to me. Yeah, primary fires. Off the sides. Hey, I made an arm. Now let's remove that R. There. Right sides. Left. That looks good to me. Okay, uh, next one up here is gonna be. Well, I found three. That works, kind of. Kind of, sort of. No. That works out. Right? He's unreactive too. I mean, speed is not of the essence here. Yep, we're gonna leave it like that. The last one, uh... Sorry, Mr. Argus. Let's get a little Africa in here. I'm torn between the bushwhacker and the catapult. Bushwhacker is just easy to take out one thing on it. Or it's easy to take out the, uh... The secondary gun rack. Suddenly there is a rave going on in my phone presently. busy. Busy trying to entertain you guys. I know, I'm failing at it. I fail at it really bad. I'm sorry. Um, like I said, this is the reason why I hate the catapult. The hard points are ass on it. 
You know what? Yeah, let's just restore that. We'll leave it at that. Yeah. We'll do that. More armor. I believe this is good. Yeah, I believe this is good. At this time around, I kind of want to take Casey, I kind of don't. I'm gonna get Jen some field time here. I'd say let's do a night mission, bud. Units, this is Control. This is our first combined operation, and timing is going to be tight. Romeo Elements running a decoy on the southern flank. X-Ray 1 and 2 will create a diversion and kill outlying static defenses. Omega, you'll neutralize any mobile hostiles. You're serving as fire support for that convoy on their way in and while they're on base. Roger. We'll keep these guys in good shape. Roger. Romeo is rolling. Confirmed. Next ray Zulu going in fast and hard. Cargo tracks are underway. Sensors online. Weapons systems online. All functioning systems nominal. Form up on me. Roger. Roger. This is Romeo 1. We're engaging two mechs on the southern flank. We'll keep them busy as long as possible. Those guys won't last long. Let's make this worth it. I'm reading two mechs powering up. Responding to X-ray fireworks. Fireworks ain't even answered.
Target destroyed. Target is terminated. Form up on me. Roger. Copy. It's about to get busy. Form on me. Roger. Copy. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Attack my target. Attack my 
my target. Roger. I didn't want to broadcast this to you while you were in the field. We just got through to her. Your sister, Joanna. She's alive. She's been working within the Resistance. Hold on. It's true. You came back. You came back. Are you alright? Joanna, it is you. I'm... I'm fine. Did anyone else make it out? No. Father... I wasn't with them when Steiner attacked. Elizabeth survived the attack, but Ian... They shot her. One of Father's security specialists got me out of the capital and here. I found out that Uncle Peter was working with the resistance, but I had no way to contact him. They didn't even want me to contact you when I found out you were in Contreras. Is there somewhere we can see each other, in person? Not yet can't be in the same place right now. We're taking a risk just talking. But I had to see her face. It's been so long. No idea what Roland has been putting people through. Denial of food, false arrests, firing on unarmed crowds while talking peace and order. People are afraid, Anne. But they're resisting. They're running Steiner forces ragged, especially since you got their ships. Roland can't project his power nearly as effectively as he needs to. Now that you're fighting back too, they'll see that they don't have to just lie down and take it. Tell me how I can help you. I'm okay. Just keep building the force Peter started. And stay safe. I will. As soon as there's... They're telling me I need to break the connection. I'll talk to you soon. Be careful. Goodbye. 
sorry we lost the signal. The resistance is nervous about communication intercepts. I'm very glad to hear your sister is all right, sir. I can barely believe it. Thanks. With your permission, I'll tell the rest of the team about your sister. Of course. Go ahead. Thank you, sir. Ian, at least told us about Johanna. I'm so happy for you. We're all very happy for you, naturally. And it's good to know we aren't all out here alone. I hope you two will see each other soon. Thanks, Jen. Oh, how heartwarming. Anyway. Defending this base is no cakewalk. Wrong button. It's not cakewalk. Max will take some wear and tear here. A lot of wear and tear. And that's just putting it very, very, very mildly. I just now realized that what I'm thinking here. Some of the mechs that we're gonna go up against in a minute are heavily lasered. Kind of. I think there's more laser here than there is actual, actual gunfire. Let's switch this over to reflective. Kind of make him force it. I'll switch myself over to reflective because they normally pick off at me. Because, you know, AI. Actually, I just had an idea. Six and six is two. Damn it. That works in the end, too. I just gotta be something kinda accurate with it. very accurate with it at that. Okay. I kind of want to keep everything off the Omni Rack. can't react to this mech. You really can't. Without some kind of really bad trade-off. Granted, the great mech. I guess that works. I guess. I could throw a flamer on there so I can overheat next, but I gotta get up close and personal with him.
You know, why not, right? Reduces efficiency like motherfuck though. Mildly laser dependent still. Which doesn't make me happy. I think I'll give the Argus to Casey and I'll give Vulture to Jules. And if memory says correctly, it rains here at night. I think. So a little bit of a cold cool off. We're gonna go with that. Light mode. Need. We're still picking up scattered contacts in the area. We assume Stan is preparing an attack on Bravo. I've got base commander Erland on comm. He's going to give you an update on what he needs. Luck. Omega Lee, this is Erland. Bravo reports they have you on long range sensors. I'm at the defensive outpost at Nav Point Alpha. I'll hold here and investigate the contacts we've been picking up. Be advised, we've lost two supply convoys in your area this morning, so be on guard for enemy forces en route. Roger that, Erland. I'll clear any enemy units I smoke out. See you at Alpha. Sensors online. Weapons systems online. All there functioning systems nominal. Let's get some Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Form up on me. Roger. Copy. Roger. Wait for it. Watch what happens here. About five seconds. Delayed one. Attention. Your base is lost. Shut down and surrender immediately. Right. Attack my target. Copy. Roger. Roger. All the misses. You don't need that leg. Shot, but good job. It's coming to early. I 
SB. Repair and reload. Roger. Omega lead, this is Erland. You got here just in time. What's up, Erland? The enemy column's headed this way. They're going for the anti-aircraft turrets on that ridge. Those turrets are the only thing defending Bravo base from their bombers. We've got to take out that column. Let's do it. This is Patrol 2-4. I'm excited a full lance of enemy mechs in the canyon just west of your position. They're headed for Bravo. This might just get a little tricky. Nav point Alpha reached. I'm not worried about the LRMs. Not that much anyway. Repair and reload. Uh, roger! Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Bravo Control, this is 2-4. Enemy units are disengaging at the outpost and headed your way. Roger, 2-4. All units fall back. Return to base and take up defensive Target positions. Destroyed. Diner will be going for the mech hangers. Defend at all costs. Repeat. Defend hangers at oh, all costs. Batteries, fire at will. We better get to that base. Sorry, sir. Unable to comply. Repair and reload. Uh, roger. I'm not worried about the shuttle and bombers either. Come on, are you that dirt to get into the damn... Yes, she is. Form up on me. Uh, roger. Roger. That's a roger. Enemy units I on base. Shit. Multiple mechs on base. All units defend the mech hangers. Rendezvous at designated nav point. Roger. Roger. Copy that. Taking a highway. Destroy. 
Roger. Copy. That's a Roger. That was too good of an opportunity to pass up just now. Take out designated target. Roger. 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 Okay. All defensive Destroy. units, we show Steiner forces and pulling one back and destroyed. We did it. Bravo is secure. Omega, thanks for your assistance. I think you turned the tide. Definitely, Omega. With the hangars intact, we'll be able to press our attacks. Thanks for the help. Glad to do it. Omega Control, looks like we're done. Bravo secured. Acknowledged, Omega Lead. Good work. Conduct repair operations at Bravo and return to Omega Base once you're set. 2-4, sweep and secure area while Omega launches down. Affirmative control. Area looks clear, but we'll patrol the perimeter while Omega gets fixed up. Target destroyed. Target is terminated. Now we're talking. Young Duke, I wanted to tell you something. In the years when you were away from home, your sister, Joanna, always supported you. She felt your father made a terrible mistake. Their relationship was never the same afterwards. I would never speak ill of Duke Eric. He was a great man. But seeing you now, I realize your sister was right. I think your father realized it too. He just didn't know how to apologize until it was too late. Thank you, Carl. He told me. I just wish I could have told him that I forgave him a long time ago. I am sorry, young dude. Commander, I just wanted to say I was happy to hear your sister's okay. Thanks, Jules. You know, I hate to admit it, but I wasn't sure we could pull it off without the Colonel. Guess I didn't figure we'd make it. I'm glad you stuck with it. So am I. Steiner doesn't know it, but they've already lost whatever happens to any of us. I just want to be around long enough to see when they realize it. I'll make sure you get a front row seat. I'll take you up on that. Ian. I wanted to tell you how much everyone here appreciates what you did. We never would have been able to hold the base against Steiner's assault without your team. Word is spreading. More people are beginning to understand it doesn't have to be this way. We can push back. We are pushing back. I've discussed something with my people. I'd like to broadcast the news of your return. I've kept my identity a secret until now, but I think it would be appropriate to let the people know that we're both here and fighting for them. If you think it's the right time. I do. A lot of people who are unsure who to support would side with the resistance if they knew there could be a legal succession. Then go ahead. You know the people of Kantaris better than I do, John. I have to go. But I wanted to tell you that your returning has already made a difference. Now that you're back, I know we can turn this around. We'll do it. Together, John. I'll talk to you soon. I'm surprised to see what we salvaged last mission, young Duke. The Donegals must have just procured them. I've never seen one before. It's a Thanatos. Brand new battle mech design. I doubt this one's seen any action until now. The paint still looks fresh. You should look it over. It can deal a lot of punishment, and it can take it. Mostly ballistic weapons, so ammo will be a factor. But in a quick fight, it'd be tough to beat. Heavy armor for its class. Can't say from experience, but this chassis could be quite solid. It'll take the punishment, that's for sure. No problem there. Capture some barges this time around. But you know what? We get to go play in water. With... Well, I don't want the Donatos. I want our new toy. Because... Damn, I'm a mad cat whore. Oh. Yeah. That's pornography. What? Machine guns. Hell. Still use those in this? Yeah, get the hell off my damn back. Come on now. About that. Yeah.
I'm gonna plant some PPCs. How about that? For starters. Still freaking fast as hell though. I'm not complaining, but you know. Uh, two of those. My heat's tanking. I want that. That works, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I got two tones. Free. I don't know what to do with it. Put two lasers on there, or... More armor for all I care. I'm gonna go with that. Like I said, we're playing in water, so I think I'm gonna sport this camo. Actually, that looks better. A wee bit better. Yeah, we can work with that. Also, let's see. What else are we going to strip down? That catapult's gone, by the way. It's done its business. Donatos, though. I'm going to run jump jets for what? I need to stop. Watch how much space I get off of this damn thing. Get one of those. I'm kind of okay with running that. Kind of. because I don't have any long, or, what do you call it, uh, gauss rifles. Not yet, about that. He's gonna go with that. Or not. This ice sucks. It's homing, and it's that close range for 400 meters. So they can see it coming. Fair enough. Yeah, fair enough. We will need that. The rest of it. Said it's a quick, fast mix. So oh, what did I do that for? Red cat, Mauler, Donatos. Whoops. My bad. This is literally a run and gun kind of mission. If you remember the train mission from uh, Mech 3, it's kind of like this. I'm gonna get six 
No! Do not get rights to that. That's later. Give me my magic cap. Control, this is Omega. We're set. Let's get this mission started. Roger, Omega lead. Savage 2, are you in position? Roger, Control. Standing by. Omega, the barge shipment should be just ahead of you. Once you take out their escorts, the barges should surrender. They're headed to an outpost at Nav Beta. We'll need to have the escorts neutralized before they reach Beta, or the Resistance won't be able to get in and salvage the supplies. Roger, Control. We'll neutralize the escorts before the barges get to Beta. Seven of those barges are packed with munitions, Omega, so watch your fire. The Resistance will need at least four of the barges intact to supply their offensive on the eastern peninsula. Acknowledge, Control. Destroy. We'll make sure that we don't wind up sinking them in the assault. Good plan. Luck. Control out. Sensors. Online. Weapons systems. Online. All functioning systems. Nominal. Close up and form on me. Roger. 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 Splash one. saving me. I don't know what Casey's doing back there, but it's pissing me off. Form up on me. Copy that. Take out designated target. Roger. Copy. That's a Roger. Don't need that. 
sitting ducks. Roger, Omega lead. Salvage, it's your show. Roger, Omega Control, we're moving in. Good work, Omega. Roger. Target destroyed. Target is terminated. Color that salvage. Close up and form on me. Roger, Roger, copy that. Move out to my nav point. Uh, Roger. Roger. That's a Roger. Go a little bit faster. I picked up this broadcast. I thought you'd like to hear it. This is the voice of freedom. Rejoice, people of Kentaris IV. Ian and Joanna, the son and daughter of Duke Eric, despite Steiner lies to the contrary, are alive and have taken up arms against the forces which seek to oppress Kentaris. While Steiner attempts to rule through their puppet William, Ian and Joanna lead a force of loyal followers to reclaim their stolen birthright. Already they have won critical victories in their struggle with Steiner occupation forces. With your help, these victories will carry them to Ajram to restore just rule. Do your part. Rise up against the oppression. Answer Steiner's theft of the throne once held by our beloved Eric. Join his heirs to restore a lawful succession and return benevolent leadership, not tyrannical domination, to the throne. Listen, Cantares, and act to restore your freedom. Well, now the people and Steiner know about you both. I'm not sure I agree with releasing this information, sir. Not yet. Until we've located the prison camp and have sufficient strength to strike it, this uprising is still quite vulnerable. Joanna believes that news of our survival and our striking back will help build support for the resistance. Undoubtedly true. But now Steiner knows the resistance has focus, leadership to rally behind. They could use that information to counter it. By killing you and your sister, for starters. We're at risk regardless. I just hope that you'll help us both from testing the value of our martyrdom. I'll do my best. Well, sir, that was a little closer than I'd like, but pulled it out. I'd like to be a fly on the wall when Roland finds out we're stomping his tin brigades and stealing all his stuff. For that matter, when he files his next report. Not too up on Steiner protocol, but when his Archon learns how the Kentaris occupation is going, it might just be disciplinary action. I hope not. I'd like to have the honors. 
When the time comes, there might be a line. Good thing you showed up early. Another intercept, sir. It appears Kulin is in the Hadra Peninsula. He's reporting in to Lord Roland. Looks like we have the whole message. I'll forward it. Lord Roland, I've ordered aerial reconnaissance and additional ground patrols to find the rebels who've been hitting targets in the area. We should have them shortly. Damn Katrina Steiner to hell. I said I needed more drop ships for an operation of this scope. I'm keenly aware of that, sir. Are you keenly aware of what I'm going to personally see done to you if you can't crush these rebels before we take any more losses? I think I can hazard a guess, Lord Roland. However, despite our setbacks, I am confident we can end this quickly. That is your supposed expertise, Captain. I suggest you start living up to your reputation. So mad though. Ah, uh, all right. I don't like this next mission at all. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw that out there. Uh, number two, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and keep the reflective armor. But in retrospect, mainly short range action here. There'd be like no reason to run something ridiculously high for freaking beam weapons or anything like that. Um okay, these are two forty, yeah. I'm running reflective because there's a Novacad in here. It's going to be the first time we see it, and that thing is an all beam loadout. Two PPCs, three ER large lasers, and a small pulse laser. I'm not worried too much about the small pulse laser, but those two PPCs I do have a problem with on top of the three large lasers. Those will rip a new one in something without a problem. Five. Half a ton. armor. I'm gonna do it like that. It may be a little bit time consuming, but it'll be worth it in the end anyway. I might just take the Mad Cat. Yeah, I may take the Mad Cat. Let's 
God forbid if it hits. Yeah, if those flames hit, that's gonna... It's definitely gonna do some serious shutdown damage there. Well, I'll keep the Mad Cat. Actually, I kinda like the loadout that we have now. Uh, Argus, 60 tons. Lokai, 65 tons. What can I do with this Lokai? Ugh, needs more armor. Oh, fair enough. Well, at least we know it can hold its own. It's quite decent, actually. I like that. I actually like that loadout. Yeah. I can deal with that, actually. Yeah, we can go with that. Because why not, right? Reflective, reflective, yeah. Oh, there's a couple awesomes here, too. So it's kind of mandatory that I run. Uh. Reflective. Cheapest amount of damage. Uh, whatever. I don't work. Get reflective armor. You know, the greatest thing about being an uncle is that you're sitting up here and you're playing a game and you can hear your niece singing at the top of her lungs in the pool to Disney songs. I don't know about anybody else out there, but damn it, I'm proud to be an uncle. Right, I think we got our loadout. Let's go. Um, this mission's foggy as hell, by the way. Ratburn, I'm nearing position. Visibility's lousy. Roger, Omega lead. There are three factories in each of the so we don't have precise location data. Rendezvous with resistance, Swiftwind. Call sign Shepard at nav point Delta. She'll be able to pinpoint the targets for you. Roger, Control. We'll link up with Shepard at Delta for target IDs. Moving out. Watch your step, Omega. This area's had a lot of enemy activity lately. Roger that. I thought the smog on Hephaestus was bad. I can't see a thing. It's not one of Kanjara's more scenic locales. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons systems online. All functioning systems nominal. Omega, this is Shepard. This is Omega Lead. Go ahead, Shepard. I'm set at Nav Delta. I know visibility's pretty bad, but I can guide you to the targets. I used to work here. Be advised the targets are pretty well armored, so once I ID them, they'll take a fair amount of pounding to bring down. I think we can provide enough firepower to handle that. Roger. Yeah, buddy. Target destroyed.
Target destroyed. Somebody can handle that. Target destroyed. That was a pretty big explosion. Receiving end of that explosion. Okay, Omega. I hope it's you I'm seeing, or I'm in a lot of trouble. A really big guy? Kinda nasty looking? I haven't worked with mechs before, have you? Um, negative. I was a cargo driver until all this started. I guess we should get moving. Lead the way. Nav point Delta reached. Alright, we get to take a little break. I pretty much get the follow behind. Shepard here for a bit. Get a quote unquote scenic tuner tour here. As Jen previously stated, not the most scenic of places on Kintaris. Form up on me. Copy. Roger. Copy that. Okay, well, I got this cooldown spot. Uh, yeah, as I stated in the beginning of the video, sorry, I haven't been uploading much. I, uh, ended up getting a killed power supply. Uh, the power supply that I had was about going on five years old and it finally decided to croak on me. So I got a replacement, the same exact one. Great condition, eBay, 50 bucks. I'm not looking forward to upgrading anything yet. I don't need, need to upgrade anything yet. Whoop, wait a minute. That's a shadow. Really? Detected. Enemy detected. There we go. There's the first one. The big structure just northeast my position. side about this level. Look at all these repair bays here. Target destroyed. Shutting down. Initiating repairs. So much repair. All the repair. Repairs completed. Target destroyed. Yeah, 
Vale. Guys, shouldn't get shot. Okay. Maybe I should have waited a little farther back. I've never seen anything that big taken out before. Two down, one to go. Let's get moving. Look, repair base. Please. 
you going? This is Omega Lead. Mission complete. It's a little smoggy. Can you give us a vector out of here? Roger, Omega. Head back 250. I'll let the Resistance know things should start getting a little easier up north. Should Target make the war destroyed. shorter everywhere. Pass on our commendations to the Resistance. Our guide did good work under pretty lousy conditions. Roger, Omega Lead. I'll pass it on. See you soon. Rathburn out. Target destroyed. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Some dude next to. Some salvage? Yeah. I think that's a good mission. Sir, your sister just received a communication from Steiner, specifically Commandant Kulin. He apparently requested to speak directly with her, and she agreed. She was pretty upset afterwards, but she's relayed the conversation and wanted you to see it. I presume I'm speaking to Miss Johanna Drissari. This is Commandant James Kulin of House Steiner. I know who you are. I'm flattered. You shouldn't be. Is there a reason for this call? Yes. I'm aware that you've been gathering up renegade military personnel loyal to the deposed government and stealing Steiner supplies and equipment to outfit them. Well, I've quite a collection of captured military personnel of my own in prisoner of war camps here and there on the planet. And what with all the supplies we've been deprived of lately, it's no longer in the best interest of my government to continue supporting them. In order to relieve the strain on resources, I will begin executing captured Davion forces, effective immediately. I'm sure you can 
can see that I have no choice in this matter. Your own actions have precipitated it. You're killing unarmed prisoners, Kulin. You, not me. It's my job to maintain peace and order among the populace of this planet. And that job often can't be accomplished without a certain degree of sacrifice. As long as it's the people of my planet who are the ones being sacrificed. It's best they accept the inevitable. Mr. Sorry, things will go so much easier for them when they do that. Young Duke, you've just salvaged a very dangerous clan Omnimech. It's a Nova Cat. Should serve us well. Your father had a couple brought back from the clan war, but this isn't one of them. I'm not sure how it wound up in Steiner hands. Has a wicked beam weapon configuration. Heat can be a problem, but it's an extremely lethal design. It's not fast, but it's heavily armored, and it has devastating weapons. I strongly recommend you consider deploying it. I have seen what it can do. I've replaced some of the power conduits, so it should be in good shape if you want to use it. Oh. Ian, it's Joanna. I spoke to your tech officer. Kulin is following up on his threat. We've just learned a number of Father's senior military personnel are being moved to the capital for public execution. But there's a chance to rescue them. We've identified the route the prisoner convoy is taking. If your team intercepted the convoy and destroyed the escorts, we could airlift the prisoners to safety. Forward me what you have, Joanna. But I'll have to discuss it with my TAC officer before I make a decision. I understand, but we have to save them, Ian. Those people were captured trying to defend Kentares. We can't turn our back on them now. Sir, I assume your sister told you about the prisoner convoy? Yes. As your TAC officer, I have to point out that, tactically, the mission has little to recommend it. The only credible evac is by air, but that necessitates taking out an air defense station and then intercepting the convoy in a very tight timeline. If that weren't enough, there is the distinct possibility that the convoy's route was leaked as a trap. So, you recommend against the rescue attempt? Wars aren't won with tactics alone. Often other factors are much more important. Tactically, this mission doesn't make sense, but the same could be said of our effort to free Kentaris. Young Duke, this will be dangerous. You'll need something fast to intercept the convoy, and that means less firepower. Best take a mix of long and short-range weapons so you can hit the air defense station at distance, but get in close when you intercept the convoy. A difficult mission, but saving the prisoners from Roland is the right decision, Young Duke. It's what makes us better than him. Ain't that the truth? Yeah, yeah I get to be good guy for the mission. Okay, we got two new mechs. Awesome. Yes, the name is awesome. That's kind of why it's awesome. But look at all that fucking heat, though, man. Damn. Uh. That's my problem. It's a beam whore. Uh... I mean, shit. <sighs> I mean, it's doable. Powerhouse. Don't get that wrong about it. It definitely is a powerhouse. Actually, not bad right there. That ain't bad. I kind of like that.
in the other powerhouse. Yeah. This thing. Walking fucking overheating tank. Literally overheating tank. Not really much to play with on this either. I could. Yeah, that's why. And I kind of like having my weapons balanced out. I will leave another cat here. I'm gonna keep my mad cat. Can't I find a ton somewhere in there to make that shit go green? Because that's annoying me now. Actually, this mission, I could... Actually, nope, I'll leave it as is. This next mission, I'm... It's, it's iffy. Sensors online. Weapons go. systems online. All functioning systems nominal. Omega lead. We're coming up on the Steiner Air Defense Site. We'll hit it fast before they warn anybody else or get their defenses powered up. Roger, Omega. Take out the radar dish and control tower first. Repeat, radar and tower first. Roger, control. Over. Tower then radar. Shot. Oh, good shot again. Attack my target. Roger. 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 Oh no, stay hot, bro. Scratch that target. Control, this is Omega lead. Air defense site destroyed. Roger, Omega. Charlie Tango 1, this is Control. Air defense neutralized. When the convoy stopped, you should be able to slip in and out with no one the wiser. Foxtrot 09er. Convoy is getting underway. Looks like two light mechs and a few tracks as babysitters. Targets are ID'd and uploaded. Roger, copy. I'm gonna take the high road for this.
Nossa, foda. Take the shot. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Oh, that salvage. 
Takeout's designated target. Uh, roger. 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 Omega lead. Looks like they're away. Roger, Omega. Break off and avoid all Steiner units. Once you're clear of our contacts, head back to me. This is Charlie Tango 1. We're clear and headed for safe ground. Thanks for the support. All units. Charlie Tango report. I better keep doing that. Oh well. Uh, I'm going to take a quick hard drive check real fast. Well, I'll be back in a minute. Sir, one of the prisoners on that convoy wanted to speak to you. She's a mech warrior who served in the forward guard. Pretty solid record. Name, Terra Risner. Patch her through. Commander, I want to thank you for the rescue. I just found out what was going to happen to us. I'm just glad I was in a position to stop. Commander, I watched my entire lance slaughtered. I just came a few hours from being executed. I'd like a chance for some payback. If your group is pushing through the desert, you'll be encountering all this Steiner slime Sergeant. and I... Major Rathburn tells me you have a solid record. Forward guards were elites. We could use you. But not if you're on some vengeance quest. You can hate Steiner all you want, but you need to stay focused on mission objectives or there's no room for you. Understood, Commander. Not a problem, sir. Get yourself cleaned up and checked out by medical. Welcome aboard, Sergeant. I look forward to serving with you. Yes, sir. Sir, I'm receiving a call from your cousin, William. He's asking to speak to you. If I answer, is there any chance of being located? Negative. I'm bouncing the signal. Patch him through. Ah, uh, cousin. <laughs> so you've been heading up this little insurrection after dear Uncle Peter finally got what was coming to him. Makes sense. You always were a nagging little thorn in my side. Why don't you come trying to pluck me out? Oh, I will, Ian. Or someone else will. It's really not important who. Or you could just get off this rock and we'll forget the whole thing. If you just disappeared, I wouldn't pursue the matter. In the spirit of family, you understand, it's not as if you haven't disappeared before. You helped Steiner murder our family. All I did was recognize superior strength when I saw it. How Steiner was going to take over Kentari's four, and I simply put myself in a position to benefit by it. Come on. It's not worth dying over, is it, this little uprising of yours? Yes, William, it is. But when I get to you, you'll be the one dying. <laughs> oh, cousin, please. I've beaten you at everything since we were children. I will again. But you won't live that long, Ian. Give it up. You could still make it out of here alive. You won't, William. I am coming for you. Yes, Sergeant? Commander, you've had a lot of missions where speed and stealth have been significant. Not the least of which was the one that got me out of that convoy. I think those have been good tactics, sir. But I don't think they're my personal strong suits. We're going to be facing some serious resistance coming up, and I'd like to get in a little closer and start directly confronting targets with more firepower. Now, I realize that it's not everyone's style, sir, but I've had good luck with larger mechs with as many weapons as I can carry. Maybe a tactic we should favor. I, I guess I'm not much for subtlety. We're a little short on atlases right now, Tara. But I'll keep in mind that you tend to favor the direct approach. Thanks, Commander. I understand that it isn't always the right tactic, but it's just the way I've been taught to fight. It's one salty chick. Sir, I haven't been able to locate the prisoner of war camp, but we have to move on. Calm intercepts indicate Steiner is moving in a strike force by ship. Once they arrive, we'll be significantly outnumbered. What about Kulin's threat to start executing his prisoners? Given his military record, sir, I have no reason to doubt him. Then we're not leaving the region without freeing them. Without knowing where they are, that'll prove rather difficult, sir. 
I don't like it any more than you do, but we've run out of time. I'm sorry. Give me your best guess, Elise. Where's the camp? Excuse me, sir. Best guess? Best guesses are no basis for mission planning. You're wrong, Major. Sometimes they're all you've got. Without additional data, sir, there's no way we your can... Your best guess, Major! That's a direct order! Oh, shit. Yes, sir. I picked up some unusual transmissions from this location last night. I haven't been able to get satellite imagery yet, but there are old records of an abandoned Davion base in the vicinity. The topography in the area would make it ideal. Nowhere to run, very defendable, and very difficult to assault. I've asked the Resistance to fly recon over the location, but they lost contact before they reported anything. I've eliminated almost every other location I can find. That's all I have. How long before Steiner has their reinforcements in the region? Best guess, sir. Six hours. Contact my sister and arrange for whatever forces the Resistance can put together on short notice to meet me at an appropriate staging location as soon as possible. If your best guess proves to be wrong, Major, we'll move on. After I check it out. Yes, sir. Hands are sorry. Confirm for badass. Okay, I don't like this mission. It's long, it's tedious, and oh my god. Ugh. There is really no best way around on this mission at all. There's vultures everywhere, there are catapults everywhere. So obvious, and they're at a height advantage, so. Ugh, and let's not forget the Uzeals are here too, so there's PPC flying everywhere. Oh god. It's just not a fun mission at all. It's not even close to being fun on top of the heat that we have. And we are going to be shooting a lot of this. A whole lot. I want Jen to keep coming up on the ranks. I'll drop Casey and take our new pilot. And hope to God for the best. Omega lead, this is Control. Omega lead, Control. Go ahead. I've uploaded all the nav data we have. The Resistance is deploying forward observation unit. We should start getting reports soon. Establish contact and rendezvous with Resistance launch Denali for updates. Roger, Control. Denali lead. This is Omega lead. Roger, Omega. This is Denali lead. We're holding position for rendezvous at Delta. Be advised I may get company. Forward observers have picked up a Steiner mech group near my location. I'll echo any forward updates. Roger, Denali. We'll hook up with you at Delta and watch out for contacts. Mechs in the area is a good sign. Steiner doesn't have enough units to patrol the bandit forward. Sensors online. Weapons systems online. All functioning systems nominal. Let's go. This is a hard enough. Ow. Target destroyed. Attack my target. Uh, Roger. Copy. Copy. Over. RC Browns, if you can spot out those turret control stations. Target destroyed. Target is terminated. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Damn.
direction. One to the front, one to the back. Already judging how it already went. I think I'm gonna go through the back. Looks like ground defenses are pretty tight. So this is the first of music that I already played through. This is Foxtrot 25 in position. Looks like this is the place. The whole mountaintop is full of enemy units. We've got what looks like four groups of prisoner barracks, a lot of enemy defenses, mixed tracks, and turrets. Roger, 25. The Nauri provides support for Omega. Neutralize all defenses and the guard towers at each of the barracks. Roger, RC. Omega, you copy? Roger, copy. Yeah, I got it. Hey guys. Two Uzeals. They're good guys. Good to see you, Omega. I'm Lieutenant Troutman, Denali lead. Our units are at your disposal. We can head straight for the front and nab Alpha, but we might face fewer defenses if we circle around back and find a way up where it's less guarded. We'll follow your lead. Roger, Denali. This is Risner, Commander. Let's just go in the front door. We need to clear out defenses as fast as possible. And can we not just YOLO the front door, please? See, the front is that way. It's heavily armored. That's the problem. And I believe there's at least 10 mechs here. So 10v6, the odds are not in our favor.
Roger. Copy. Copy. Over. Destroyed. 
up designated target. Uh, Roger. Copy. Roger. That's the kill.
it. Salvage. 